Hey everybody, it's me, Coach Risner. Today I'm going to show you a set of exercises that we call a power triad. The first two exercises are meant to strengthen your legs so that with each step you're going to be stepping further. The last exercise is meant to increase your cadence or the number of steps that you take per second. And those two things together are going to increase your overall speed. We'll also look at one last exercise called the agility cross, which will help to strengthen your ankles and improve your steadiness on your feet. The only equipment that you're going to need for this will be something to step up on that's approximately knee height and sturdy, and then something approximately six inches high like a single stair. Now the first exercise are step ups. And what you're going to do is you're going to, on one leg, stand on a surface that's approximately knee height. You're gonna balance yourself. You can wear shoes for this if you want to, but you don't have to. And you're going to lift yourself all the way up. And then you're going to slowly lower yourself down. And then right before your foot hits the ground, lift yourself up again. You're going to do 10 to 15 repetitions on one leg before switching to the other leg. The next exercise will be single leg lunges. The way you're going to set up for this is you're going to put your back foot on a slightly raised surface, a step, ideally. You're going to lower yourself down slowly. You're going to do 10 to 15 repetitions before switching to the other leg. And that would be one set. The last exercise is single leg hops in place. You're trying to do this for speed and you're going to go for a certain amount of time. Because it's difficult to time yourself on these, understand that everyone has their own ability. I usually can get in three hops per second. And so while the exercise might be for 10 seconds, I'm really just going to count to 30 in my head for total foot contacts on one foot before switching to the other leg. Now last is an exercise we're going to call the Agility Cross. You may have heard it called other names in different places. You're going to pick a place on the floor mentally and you're going to jump in front and then hop back and then hop to the side and then hop to the other side. So that would count as four contacts or four jumps. You're going to do that a set number of times and then you're going to switch to the other foot. All right, so I hope that helped you understand what you need to do and these exercises to help you get faster throughout the season. You'll start off by adding more repetitions. If you started off at 10 reps per set, then you would move it up to 15, maybe just for the middle set, and then you would eventually move it up so that all of them are at 15. Once you get to 15 repetitions though, for those first two exercises, the strength ones, you'll want to start adding weight instead. You really don't wanna do more than 15 of those because then you're not working those real strength muscle fibers as much. Let me or any of the other coaches know if you still have questions about how to progress through this or about the exercises themselves. Good luck.